you are listening to the Landed Bolts podcast, local awesome podcast about everything skating, where we always land primo. Welcome to the podcast. If you've never been here before, we are filmed on site. Today we are at the gorgeous Lakewood Park in Leander. It is pretty sunny, getting absolutely blinded right now, and uh, you might hear quite a bit of background skating. Some There's some pros here that are throwing down some massive tricks. Average age probably of eight. <clears throat> but anyways, today I am joined by co-hosts Hayden, Matt, and Johnny. And today's topic, we're going to be talking about skateboard tricks. Very general topic. Trying to keep it open so we, uh, you know, we uh, we appeal a little bit to everyone. You know, try to keep it uh, try to keep it simple. So I'm going to start us off. Going to go around the circle. Hayden, what's your favorite trick ever? And then what's your favorite trick that you can actually land? Favorite trick ever. Um, I don't know, I feel like kickflip crook is just like a really good looking trick. Or like, uh, you do if you do like crook, pop over to like switch crook. That's always a sick one. And then favorite trick that I can do. Yeah. I'd probably say, I don't know, crook on rails feels nice. And that's like, like crowd pleads or people love seeing that one. So. Crooks on a rail? Like Crook, Crooks on a rail. Here's a question. Hardcore. Would you rather do crook on a circle rail or a flat rail? Circle all day. I will never skate a fucking square rail. That is the worst thing in the world. <laughs> the circle is a flex, right? I mean, you know, you're landing, you're landing rail tricks on a circle. Honestly, I'd say if you're hitting square rail and you're pinching, that is a flex. You're, you're bonkers if you can pinch on a square. That, yeah, I mean... I don't know anything about it. I don't skate rough. <clears throat> Matt? Uh, I guess my favorite trick ever have to be Kareem Campbell's Ghetto Birds. The the Nolly version on like hips. You know. All right. You ever seen this? Yeah, yeah I know what okay. you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, sorry. I'm naughty. Um, but yeah, no, favorite favorite trick that I could do is definitely kickflip. Kickflip's a go-to. Solid. You know. Solid. Keep it casual, keep it simple. Keep it bolts. Keep it bolts, baby. Always. Always. <laughs> Hashtag Lennon bolts. Hashtag Lennon bolts. <clears throat> Johnny, what, what, what's your favorite? I would say my favorite, a little goofy, is any like power slides or reverts of any sort. I That's see respect. I see people go all over the place, transition flat, you name it. They're just super goofy. Um, so that would be like my favorite. And then I don't know, a couple that I like, rock and roll or rock to fakie. Scared, cool. scared me for years, but you know, it's a good little one uh, mm-hmm. to land. Transition. I know Johnny's got some sick transition game. <clears throat> you know what? Actually, with it. if you don't mind, I'd like to go back to my favorite trick I can do. Mm-hmm. Back tails and transition feel so stellar. Like yeah, when you're so- like just crooking your body, you don't look like it's attached anymore. You're like a barber that like, got ran over. <laughs> it's amazing. You look like a Family Guy death scene, but you're sliding. Yeah. <laughs> I uh, I filmed first. First back tail. Oh yeah. Sure, you know. Know. I saw that clip on the gram. Follow us on Instagram, by the way. Yeah. You should. Uh, there should be links to all of our social medias. We're all verified. We're all verified. We Blue are check all. marks. Please. Hey. Blue check mark. Hey, don't, Red. Don't, put, don't put mine in there. Yeah. <laughs> Except for Hayden. Hayden, uh, Hayden would bring a little too much heat. That's no. true. I talk, I talk some shit sometimes. I let my nuts hang. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just go ahead and say my favorite trick. That it just I'm just going to go with flat ground. <clears throat> just keep it simple. Straight. Forward flip. I feel like forward flip looks super dope. And it's like a banger trick. It's one of those things where like, you bust it out, and it's like, it's like, you know what you're doing. You can just come in, just lay one of those down hard, right? Favorite trick that I can land, gotta be the fakie big spin. It's uh, really consistent for me, feels good. Uh, Feels good just to like, sling it and just, it just feels natural to me. Now I don't even pop it, but, Another thing is about me that I, I can actually do fakie big spin better than I can do a half cab, which uh, I don't know if that's normal. But. I feel like that's pretty normal for a lot of people. There's, yeah. something, there's something about like that body rotation where like with a half cab you kind of have to pop it, but with a big spin you can kind of just like, you can just like wind that. it up. Wind it up yeah. and get going. All right, uh, so one big activity in skate that revolves a lot about tricks. Gotta be the game of skate. I know we've all played skate. Johnny, have you played skate? I don't think I've ever seen you play skate. I'm a, I'm a, uh, yeah, I play it, dude, on the off hours. Oh, yeah? <laughs> very night. suddenly. I like playing everything goes. 
Oh yeah, oh, nice. thing everything goes. The game. hardest rules. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything goes can get crazy, and uh, sometimes it's cool. Sometimes it's like the dude doing everything goes knows something you can't do, and they just do it over and over again. It's like, yeah, uh, uh, that's kind of bad. All right, but anyways, we're gonna talk about when you play skate. What are some of the rules that you go by? We know Johnny just <laughs> whatever the <laughs> he wants. Chaotic energy. Yeah, just you know. And then, uh, what are some of the things that you, uh, you know, just, just how do you play? What do you think? Uh, well, general rule, I just play barracks. Like, that's like, they, it's a pretty strong foundation of yeah. how to play. Like, you know, no multiple mani sh No feet on the ground, no grabs, that type of stuff. So I feel like barracks is good. Yeah. Barracks is solid. <coughs> but I will say, after playing a few times, I definitely see why they say no feet on the ground yeah i think it's because if you do a no comply there's no real way to police how long your foot stays on the ground yeah yeah so I've, you can seriously like cheese your way through like almost any no comply trick even without being able to do it at all yeah so i think yeah, i always go barracks if it's a friendly game like you yeah. know it's still barracks but like you loosen the rules a little bit like i'll let you redo on like offense and shit like that Mm -hmm. Give you like an extra letter or an extra try, but barracks generally best way to go. Yeah. Yeah. I now barracks rule is definitely my go-to too as well. Yeah. I think we should allow manuals. Personally, just kidding. That'd be horrible. <laughs> That's I, a mistake. I, combo I, trick. <laughs> yeah. Combo trick. Yeah, I'm gonna do. A, I'm gonna set Nolly into a in a nose manual into shove out. Yeah, it's one trick. Yeah, it's, it's all one trick. Trust yeah. me, bro. If you multiplier. Mess up, three three you, times yeah. multiplier. If you mess up the nollie, you get three <laughs> letters because you messed up the two other tricks after it, too, right? <laughs> I feel like that's how the elites play. Well, but like the the reason with like Malta was like he did like kick flip to like manual and just man like the rest of the yeah. barracks. Yeah, and then I've, counted it. Yeah, well, and then the and then it just like spiraled where they looked at the the rules and stuff. You know, I will say, what's your opinion on the current? battle at the barracks swell that's all that's awful like it's so like watching barracks like four years ago versus now it's so different it's yeah it's honestly like and i really like like what they're doing with like the pro versus joe type thing i think it only makes it worse with like all the joes are just kariyuma riders like they're just they're like like not actual <laughs> joes it's like dude it's all kariyuma have, like, yeah. yeah, it's yeah. it's like they just ride for Kariuma. Yeah. Like it was cool when it was like Chris Chan, like like YouTube skaters. Like that yeah. was kind of sick. That was neat. Yeah, I mean now but, they have that like the influencers section. Yeah, yeah. Which, I, and that's what it's supposed to be. It's like pros versus influencers, but it's just like Kariuma and then like yeah. Sunny Soldier. I've also um I've heard a lot of reports of like thrown games this whole year. Oh. Like a lot of people are starting to just throw games through. Like what's that last one mm. where it was uh, that one primitive dude? I forgot his name. But like was it he Tiaga? was No, nah, it wasn't Tiago. Ah, whatever. He was just playing the game and he like he like got in a phone call it was like an important call and like oh, he just like stopped skating yeah. basically. Yeah. He was just like, oh kick flip, we'll just push it that way and we'll just oh, call yeah. it a day. Yeah, uh, yeah, I I know I've heard some complaints going on the internet that the influencer section is extremely unbalanced and that yeah. like people that are like skate influencers but mostly just like are there for something. You know, they they're not yeah. like actually throwing down yeah. throwing down like unbelievable tricks going yeah. up against people that can yeah well it was, yeah. Like, it was like that burberry airy one where it was like he messed up a kickflip but he did like nolly tray yeah that yeah and that was a weird one it was like oh okay well he can just do tray flips and he did tray flip like every position besides like switch i mean that was probably just nerves but yeah, i mean that's true I, too i feel like that um I was, I was also like, do we really need Burberry Air at the Burberry? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's choking me up just thinking about it. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's funny that like um, Chris Chan has like more followers than the Barracks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just, like, or give me like Johnny Geiger. He was supposed to be on there, and it's just been a no show. That would that would have been actually a cool. Geiger one. Geiger would have been a great. That, yeah, that, that would have been like cool because like he has like those crazy ass flat tricks. It's like it's like do we really count that? Yeah, it's um, all, he's I do remember um, Battle at the Barracks Eleven with COVID and everything since it was all online. Uh, Johnny had went against, I think, like, Andy Anderson. Andy was pulling out all the Andy tricks, yeah. and they were like, well, we'll just let them go. I mean, they're weird, but... And Johnny was, like, not having it, so... I think that's, that's why weird, he didn't return like, they're both on the same level. For real, they yeah, are both, like, yeah, Johnny could definitely do 
everything that like Andy can do, but he was just like, I mean, this goes against battle with the barracks rules. Like Andy's throwing out, you know, no holds barred tricks. And it's like, you know that I could do it myself, but it's just like, how are we allowing this? I remember yeah. that the clip where he like raged out a little bit. <laughs> yeah, no, I, that's another thing that's like interesting about like the, the rule sets where it's like, I feel like there are still a lot of things you could like push into. Yeah. And I mean, in the end, it's just for fun. Yeah. So yeah, like, yeah. that's what it should be. I really, one thing about skate, people that will just play to win at any cost. Most of the time, you know, I know I can smoke like anyone here, but I want to give like a chance. So I'll throw something that I know my opponent can do, you know, just, and then I go for the, for the hammers. Speaking of hammers, what's your favorite hammers in the game of skate? In the game of skate? What do you, what can you do that you don't think a lot of other people can do? Um, switch big spin, switch heel. Um, just riding down the switch line. Just switch in general. That's yeah, a, a lot of people happening. don't practice switch. Like, yep. Really, dude, I've played against games with dudes where like I've had like, the hammer be like switch back so I win. Like, uh, people like don't skate switch, which is, you know, play a game of skate against somebody who skates switch. And, like, dude, I don't think enough people take skate. Like, when you're talking about, like, yeah, it's fun, but take a little series and, like, yeah. pick up. It's like, oh, that's where I can't do that. Like, oh, my kick flips are consistent. I should work on that. Definitely. I, uh, I think that the game of skate can definitely help like highlight some of the things that you wouldn't normally you know recognize just skating on your own yeah like i can get into a, a sesh where i just skate comfort tricks like non-stop it's like i'm not even going to push my boundaries a tiny bit but then when you you know play with a brando or play with the, one of your homies and you're forced to do something that's like out of your comfort zone you can see like oh yeah. Maybe I should uh, I should work on something else. I've yeah. landed some of my first tricks in games of skate just having to Same. having to throw them and then yeah, just being like I've never tried out. this before and actually it's not that hard. I yeah, I've never tried this before. Yeah. 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 I remember during that game of skate contest, I was like the end of the summer type thing, and I was playing against that one dude. He did like nollie heel, and I, like I learned nollie heel like the day before. <laughs> That's <laughs> like, insane. And I, I did that trick like boom, it was like right there. I was like yeah, that was we it. got it. We I had it. that. <laughs> I had that on lock already, obviously. Yeah. What about it's you? It's lightweight. Um, no one can really do flower flips or know what a flower flip is usually. It's it's a wrapped front shove around the front foot and like, uh, from like certain angles you could really just like cheese one and then people wouldn't know if it's like a full wrap or if it's a front shove but if you name call it a flower flip people will, you know, be like, yeah. oh well, you know, I'm, I don't even know how to like go towards doing that, you know what I mean? Yeah. So that's definitely my your like, hammer trick. trick that's yeah. one. How? Yeah. I mean, that seems like one that I've never even heard of. It's, it's yeah. dirty. It's like a half impossible. Yeah. Uh, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Half, it's like a half front foot impossible. Yeah. Yeah. Half yeah front it's, foot it's, impossible. it's. But it doesn't wrap like an impossible. It like. Wraps yeah. No, like it really. Shield. Yeah. It's it's oh, a no, weird okay. type of wrap. It's not really vertical. It's more just a. It's mad illegal. Yeah. Yeah. We'll be questionable. We'll get to that. Yeah. Hey, not even yeah. questionable. Like, <laughs> you're not in the park, like. We are calling the cops. Yeah. <laughs> the cops will show up if the fire flip is done. Yeah. The lesser known hospital flip. Yeah. Yeah, I, I was yeah. I would agree. Yeah. All right. You know a hospital flip is like a little different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still. Yeah. Like besides like the flick and all that, it's like yeah. A yeah, I was I was kinda of wondering, it's it's yeah. so it seems similar, very similar to a hospital flip. <laughs> yeah, it really yeah. is. I mean a, a hospital flip, um, what is the difference? Uh, hospital flip like, like has, hospital flip and like and flower flip. So oh well, the way that I try thinking about it is a like hospital a hospital flip's more of like less of a wrapped back shove, but more of a wrapped like vertical flip in a way because it still yeah. half flips because and it way, flips back. Yeah, the way you're doing it is like you're setting up for like a varial flip, but when you flick out, it's wrapping like on yeah. your front of the foot. But as a flower flip, you're like doing a shove it, but it's just wrapping yeah. on your foot. Yeah. You don't really have to like go for like that heel flip thing. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Johnny? I would say my favorite to throw in a regular game of skate that gets people in hot water is like a 360 shove. Dang. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, um, it's a good one because people, yeah. will, I mean, I played with people who have like trays on lock and they can't throw a 360 without it flipping or something like that. Yeah. So that's a good one to. That's a control trick. That's a fun yeah, one. Yeah. Mine's got to be like a switch shove it 
or like a weirder shove it, like a fakie front side shove it. Mm, yeah. Just something that you can kind of like, I can land every every try and then I can see how my opponent does it. And I can immediately tell if it's gonna be easy breezy cakewalk or if it's gonna be tough. Yeah. Right, yeah. <laughs> yeah, because a lot of people, uh, I feel like once they move past those tricks, they don't really go back and do it anymore. Right. So it kind of like creates a weakness um, that you know, maybe you could, maybe uh, some yeah. kryptonite there. Yeah, maybe no, exactly. Yeah. Exploit the f out of somebody who can't skate that thing. Yeah. Maybe if you're playing against me, you might have to do seven shovets. I mean, it could be a thing. I used to be that person. <laughs> I used to, I would, if I played a game of skate, I was like, I'm not going to flip my board once. I'm just going <laughs> to do shovets and see what I can get on. Yeah. Now you can get a lot of letters that way. Oh, yeah. Pretty quick. One thing in the game of skate I hear thrown around illegal tricks, also just the term illegal tricks. So we're gonna discuss like what we believe, what what makes a trick illegal? Is it people don't do it often? Is it difficult? Like what what do you think of when you think of an illegal trick? For me, when I say illegal, what I mean is was like that trick was ugly. Don't ever do that again. <laughs> so you look at it as a visual, like yeah. I mean, like with how skateboarding is, <laughs> it is extremely visual. Like if it's not pleasing to the eye, we don't want to look at it, of course. True. So, like, why are you doing a laser flip? <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> wow. Damn. Wow, that came, that that came was, quick. That was hot. No, there's a lot of legal tricks. There are tricks that it's like, there's some where it's like, yeah, like, I guess this is hard, but it also looks nasty. And it's like, there's others where it's like, that is a hard trick. I wish it looked good, but that it, it looks terrible. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel like the techier the tricks get, the less like style is really thrown into yes. it. Because you just sort of throw the trick and it's like, oh, well, I caught it. Yeah, I so it. I've it had a conversation right. with a friend about this. And like, there are illegal tricks that can be good. It's really about execution. <laughs> like, if, if you can do the trick good, you might get a pass. Oh, gotcha. So like, depending on how crisp or clean you hit it. Yeah, okay, like, you know, we were talking about like, like, ghetto birds like kareem campbell like what about like shove it rewind shove it rewind is pretty nice i if it I, sees it, uh, yeah. maybe, maybe most shove it rewinds that i see it seems like people just do like an ollie by barrel and see, then do see, it like some people don't even do the full shove yeah, it makes it illegal right I'd, I'd have to agree with that one yeah see, it's about execution most of the time there are, there are exceptions there are people who make these tricks look good but i'm gonna say for the most part it's either like some little kid shit or it's like, or it's like, it just looks disgusting. Don't yeah. do that. Do you, we, oh, do you guys think double flip tricks? Legal. Illegal. Illegal. Illegal? Illegal. Yeah. All day. That, well, mine was going to be like a double flip tray. Like, that's just dumb. Uh, that's Shane O'Neill. Yeah. yeah, it's like anything Shane O'Neill ugly. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. That's are Shane O'Neill slander. Are you saying Shane O'Neill's ugly or Shane O'Neill's tricks are ugly? we got to clarify. I, no, 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 he's, he's technical. Uh, it seems like we have a guest caller. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Shane, go ahead. Phoning it in. I will, give, I will give it he's technical, he's talented, but he throws such like technical tricks that they just don't even look good. So double I, I want to ask real quick. Are we talking about primitive Shane O'Neill or we're talking about April Shane O'Neill. Slightly different styles, I'll say. When he was on Primitive, he was a little bit bucker with the, with those illegal tags. Mm -hmm. Really? Oh, mm -hmm. I, I would say I would say more recent, more recent O'Neal. He's getting back to it. I'll he's say. getting back to it. He's getting back on his shit. I, I really hate that he does them because he's such an amazing skater. Like, he's, he's one of those dudes where like I watch it and like if I compare myself to him, like I'm just gonna burn my skateboard. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> just retire. Yeah, he's one of those dudes that's just like he's probably gonna be like a legacy skater, you know? Where it's like like five years or like ten years from now when see he has like kind of retired from skateboarding yeah like people are, are still gonna be like yo you remember that shane o'neill part just throwing everything double remember, flip everything remember we did a gazelle spin down a 10 stair For it's gonna be it's gonna be like one of those teams, yeah which is yeah. which is dope he's a, he deserves it. he's an amazing skater so co-producer hayden has given us a list of what he believes are illegal tricks. Can I add real quick? Uh, this isn't even the entire list. I had to stop myself a little bit. There oh are some, there's some good features on here. Self-control. I was going to go crazy and just start naming off like tricks that I was like, this could borderline be good. But I'm like, illegal scale. So we got, uh, what do you guys think about late, late tricks? Late shove, late flip. Not a lot think? of people got them like that. They don't. Good. Yeah. I say execution. We going back to execution. If they're yeah. done right, they look great. Yeah. See, they're dirty. They're death blows though. See, sure. I know. Yeah. There, I mean, there's a dude here, Daniel, like in Austin, and he has 
beautiful nolly late front flip, like front foot kick flip. Yeah. What? Beautiful. He's an absolutely amazing skater. He does a lot of illegal tricks, but he does them really well where I can look past it. That's one of those yeah. things I'll say. So I feel like there's a time and a place, but I feel like a lot of them is like little kid shit. Like, it's yeah, like hot play. take. Any trick that an HP kid does in one edit, you will see it in every single one of their edits. That's true. I mean, they all like, I guess it's one of those Impossible. things. Impossible. Like, we learn from our peers, you know? Yeah. I'm going to learn something from someone else. Like, if Chris, yeah. if Chris is sitting now and we're doing fake humanities, I'm going to learn fake humanity. Yeah. Yeah, no, but I'm saying, like, you go to any one of their pages, and I swear to you, in every edit, there's at least one impossible, and it's not even the full uh, rap. Yeah, it's just not even weird, rapping the foot. Yeah, 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 it's not even They're in the possible. It's, uh, it's, <laughs> I feel like. I feel like trendiness definitely makes a trick illegal at some point. You see it too many times, it's just sort of like, okay, we get it. Like, Trade flip. Let's Trade get flip. on with it. Yeah. Trade no. flip. I mean, Trade flip. flips, like, at the top of my list where it's like, I hate seeing them now. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, wouldn't say tra flip. I, I would say Trade flips are still legal. It's just an overused trick. Yeah, yeah. No, it, yeah. But overused does overused, sure. where, do, where do we push overused when it's ugly. to illegal? Ugly. So if, if you should use it too. Trade. Like, dude, I, too. I've seen people do kickflips and I'm like, that was an illegal kickflip. That was an <laughs> ugly kickflip. It's like a rocket just going straight yeah. up. Yeah, or they got like the, the like the flick down and just like so Yeah, there are certain the people ground. certain people we won't name, but they will literally pop it and you can see the peak and then out of nowhere the late flip and they it's like a, it's, 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 it's yeah, it doesn't certain yeah I don't like counting those. Yeah. yeah. Certain uh <clears throat> certain Yeah, but anyways. Uh, <laughs> on to the next trick. <laughs> You got uh, our co-host Hayden believes three shows should be on here. What like do you guys just, think of that? It's illegal. It's an illegal trick, but I will say, game escape. It's good. I yeah. think a three show. Keep in the back pocket. Mm, it's an ugly sexy. trick, but yeah, you landed. I think it's sexy. Well, dude, I'm not gonna like. I don't want to say I'm not going to respect it's kind of ballsy, but if you do like a three shove down like a five stair, massive. You're That's, a weirdo. You're a weirdo. Yeah. You're, you're out of weirdo. control. I Unhinged. feel like it's one of those tricks where. There's such a slim margin for error. Like you have to do it 100% perfect. Yeah. yeah. Or you will eat absolute shit. Yeah. I personally just me like I don't like three shoves. Like if I see like a straight part and somebody's doing a three shove, I'm gonna click out. <laughs> this is not for me. This part's not for me. Yeah, and I'm guilty of it, dude. Like I've done like gnarly three shoves down into banks and stuff like that before, and it's like it's illegal. It, yeah, it's mad illegal. But I don't know. I didn't know better. I was young. I was illegal. Kid. Kid. Um, Kid body burial tricks. We're gonna we're gonna use the term body burial so we don't get demonetized. Um, <laughs> not that we're monetized. <laughs> Please give us money. Uh, but yeah, body burial tricks. Illegal. All of them. For sure. All of them. Every single one. There's there's one thing I wrote on there. And it's called a magic grind, and it is like maybe the one exception because I wrote it down simply because it is illegal. But it is an amazingly beautiful trick. I but noticed it's um, illegal. Magic Grinds is right underneath Skinny Pants. Yes. What do you guys think of that? Uh, there's another one mm. down that I might have Skinny apply. Pants is a trick? Yeah. Um, I also see one here that says. Um, I don't I don't see a lot of people rocking the skinny jean fits anymore. Is that, is no, that, no yeah. it, it's blown out. The only person I know now is like Burberry Area, and I just straight up hate his style, <laughs> period. Like Burberry Area, why do you exist? Yeah. Please Whoa. delete, delete Allegedly. your Allegedly. No, no, Allegedly. no allegations Slander. whatsoever. I hate Burberry Area. I'll say it into the mic. <laughs> Burberry Area, if you ever see this episode, I swear to you, come to me face to face, and we will have a nice long talk, and we're, I will be on your side. We're gonna get an email from at Burberry uh, <laughs> official saying I want to be on the podcast in the YouTube. Comments. Bring that rando wearing the camo pants <laughs> who is mentioned on here. If you're wearing camo pants, nothing you do counts. <laughs> I, I can agree with that. <laughs> oh, that's great. That's just that like, huh, oh, that's interesting. That's, uh, yeah. Yeah. There are exceptions. Uh, Matthew's not one of them, but there are exceptions to this. If it's a good pair of camo I'd like pants, to resign yeah. as a co-host for the podcast. Now, what just if it's, like, what if it's ca after. camo skinny pants? <laughs> the, are, are you, should, should you be revoked from, like, uh, right? I'm you, gonna, you I'm, don't skate anymore, sir. I'm, I'm going to take a, <laughs> Board focus. a phrase from Gifted Hater and just say dungeon tier. <laughs> <laughs> dungeon tier. What dungeon even tier. camouflage skinny pants? No, I've never say. seen that before. We're joggers. That we'll about this I'll show bottom. up to the party um, next, next time with him. When I first started skating way back in, like, 2006, uh, in middle school, skinny pants just becoming a thing. Mm -hmm. I hated it every second of it. It was awful. I, I, sure. I think yeah. everybody's been victim of skinny pants. Everyone. I remember kids they were buying. Well, it's Crew. Crew was the big brand oh, back in the day. Yeah. 
But before that, the gym you'd, gecko skinnies. Yeah, the gym gecko skinnies. Sixty pairs. Nut huggers. You'd rip them. Mom would be screaming at you. Um, I remember getting the uh, the like Levi's five elevens, and then mm. like you wear them in the bathtub so they get skinnier. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So there's something that I feel attacked on here. Uh, not popping into manuals. Illegal. I can see it. I feel it now yeah. that I, now yeah. that I can pop into manuals. I look back at my old clips where I was just doing manuals on flat, and it's like. There's nothing wrong with it. You gotta start somewhere, but yeah. I will say though, doing that, I, mean, yeah, right, I got go. that. I got that that foundation See? to build from. So yeah, I feel like that's, that's the thing with like a lot of illegal tricks. Like I was saying, like they're foundation blocks, but they're illegal. Like it's kids. Yeah. So I think we can agree. Um, illegal tricks mostly are illegal due to how they look. Are like what the level most people learn the math. Yeah. Like another one. What about a trick that's relatively easy but no one really does? Why? I kind of see that with like Ollie body burial tricks. I don't know if it's necessarily the ugliest thing in the world. I mean, it is. But it's also something that like I learned it in like 30 minutes. Yeah. Maybe even less than that. But it's like no one does it. So I learned both the regular and the fakie version. And I've got that in my pocket. Just about, you know, if I'm playing skate against someone that I really want to just put some letters on, that's relatively easy to like catch someone out with. See, I, I'm i saying it's illegal because like, what are you, are you gonna do an Ollie body burial like <laughs> down like a euro yeah. or some shit? Absolutely. Like, you're not Brian Arnett. You're not doing You gotta go that. to House Park for that. Absolutely yeah. not. Yeah, you know, on, on the illegal thing, like anything Stephen Lawyer does, <laughs> if you watch his parts, he does a lot of illegal stuff. Like, he'll do like board bonks, like, like all the way over a handrail, and then like board bonk the handrail while he's going over. Like, what he like sends the board down, it pops, he catches it, and then like keeps going. See, that seems cool to me, but also. But he doesn't wear any like pink camel pants. Oh, well, whoa, it completely. Whoa, whoa. completely so you're breaking it. a lot of rules here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. no. It, Steve, it Steven was. Lawyer is the king of illegal. I'll say that. <laughs> what do you guys, how do you guys feel about like anything like hippie jump through like. Uh, hippie jump on the list. Oh, oh, oh is it okay, really? good. Okay, yeah. all right. Like pop hippie jumps or just. Yeah, pop hippie yeah. jumps like through mm. like bars. Because you've or, seen like, pop games. hippie jumps, right? Where, like, no, yeah, when they do like a kickflip hippie jump. Yeah, kickflip hippie jumps. Or yeah, hippie flips. Hippie flips too. Dude, I don't know. That's a hard one. I'm gonna say illegal. I've, I don't. I don't think I've ever seen any bad hippie flips. If you're trying hippie flips, like you have to have what the whatever heck flip you're going is a for. Hippie like. flip. So okay. So imagine there's like oh, a you rail do a right flip. here. Is there the heroic? board does the kick flip. And then you're going. Yeah, like say so yeah. 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 So you're still like popping the kick. Yeah. Yeah. You're yeah, still, you doing, have you're still to, doing yeah. the trick. You just have to disconnect from the yeah, board it's, briefly for a second. No, it's if weird. You, it's a really weird. If trick. you imagine there's a railing and you ollie and you. you yeah, go no, over I've and seen the it before, like a popped hippie that, jump where it's that, just like an ollie. But. Yeah, but is that called a hippie jump or would that be called an ollie hippie jump? I think it still just characterizes hippie a hippie jump, yeah. I still say just a hippie jump. Yeah. So does it still count even if you just if you just leap off your board on the ground though? That still counts as a hippie jump? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So the Ollie Illegal. But you would call it a Illegal. kick flip hippie jump. I I think you call it, it a just, hippie flip. It's a hippie flip. I would from just what call I it illegal. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna transition into confusing names for tricks yeah. at this point. Front side, front side and backside block. I heard a lot of, a lot of, on that one. Yes. Yeah, I think all the hoes went. <laughs> yeah. Mm, mm, Skateboarding yeah. terminology. Skateboarding. Whack. I will say I was looking up some stuff this morning to try to, uh, you know, get that spiciness to try to pick some, some really weird named tricks, and it just made me laugh about some of the, uh, <laughs> some of the descriptors I read online where it's like, I didn't watch a video. I just was reading what someone had yeah. described. And it's like, it's like an ollie where you don't, you push down and you spin and your board flips halfway and you flip over and catch, and it's just like. Was that a big spin? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Was that literally any skateboard trick yeah. ever? So. But anyways, so front side, back side. There's one thing that I notice that comes up, at least for me, nollie tricks, like Nolly shove it. Hmm. Which one is which? So, I think the better one for it would be like fakie. Fakie shove it? 
Yeah, well, I mean, so like fakie front side means it's going behind you, and fakie back side means it's actually going in, in front, front of you. Yeah. yeah, so you're scooping the board backwards on a back side, and then you're pushing the board forward on a front side. Yes. Yeah. But then in but Nolly... For Nolly, it does switch. Oh, in, it does. Yeah, I've, I've, heard, I've heard some people say it switch, and I I'm sort of on the switch back. The switch and I've also wagon, heard but. the opposite. Yeah, I've no, you, the, you tell anyone that it switches a nolly, like, you'll get into a serious argument about it. Like, people true. don't want to... People will throw hands at that. Yeah, like... Like, I've seen, I've seen some shit go down. Not really. Mostly no. it's just like, instead of naming it, I'm just going to do it. And you do the yeah. one that I did, and we can agree to disagree Yeah, it's like yeah. what the name is. It's like yeah. when people are like, they're like, oh, which way did that shove it go? It's like, that way. Yeah. Yeah. It went that way. Yeah, you Front side. side or back side? Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah, this side. Especially when you start dealing with different stances and stuff. Yeah, it, gets, it gets murky real quick. Yeah. yeah. I will say I've looked it up on the internet, and the nollie backside is the one that goes in front of you, where you scoop it backwards. Mm. But I know people that will just they will not re they refuse. They say that's definitely front side, and so it makes me doubt myself. Like, well, I don't. The, the I don't know where. This. I don't know where I first heard where it switched, but ever since I heard it, it like sticks in my mind. But if I ever tell anyone like Nolly it switches, they're like, "What are you talking about?" Yeah. Like, it's it, it's still a shove, and I'm like, I mean, yeah, if you want to get technical about it, though, like switch it. And you're like, no, shut up. I think just like, do what, a Nolly shove. I yeah, think what we need to do in skateboarding is like, I feel like giving tricks names is a terrible idea. We should just be like, that was cool or that was bad. <laughs> it was like, that was a cool trick. Yeah. Hayden imagine? wants to go into the caveman era of skateboarding. I think that's what we need, to be honest. Simplify like, it. Yeah. It's like, what was that? It was a cool trick. It's like, game of, game of skates are going to be like the most fun thing in the world now. You do a cool thing, I do a cool thing. <coughs> Seems like it could get a little bit more subjective. Like, yeah, yeah and then, cool. then, yeah. then it's going to be like, well, this is cool trick and this is bad trick. <laughs> that's going to be like your, your cool argument. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, that's when you have your yeah, it's caveman be, club. Yeah. 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 Cool trick, cool trick. Mm. <laughs> but yeah, um, another thing. You don't like that bad trick. <laughs> so one, no flower flip. <laughs> one thing that confused me when I was younger. I was playing Tony Hawk. And I couldn't understand why the front side board side I was looking backwards and the back side board side I was looking forwards oh and it confused the absolute crap out of me and I was like have you played Tony Hawk that thing's glitched look yeah. I'm doing front side well, I actually thought that you were gonna point out there have been some discrepancies in Tony Hawk games where like tricks will be renamed or tricks yeah. will be like wrongly named or they just won't be they won't be like I don't know how they mistake it for like one trick, but it will be listed as one trick when it's a completely different trick. See, I think, but, um, I think a lot of it when we come to naming tricks, like a lot of us learn it from like Skate 3 and shit like that. Yeah. Like, yeah, it's a big thing with like our like, yeah. generation. Is like yeah. a lot of us got into skateboarding from video games yeah. and shit yeah. like that. It's like you play Skate 3 and it's like you learn all your tricks from Skate 3. So Skate 3 got it wrong. We all have it wrong. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. But yeah, no, when I first started getting into the whole like you know, the grind scene, um, it did seem sort of weird to me that, like, front side was now a back 180 into something, and back side was a front 180 into something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I guess it, it makes sense from, like, where you're looking at it, but it doesn't make sense to anything else in skateboarding. Like, it it completely flips the status quo. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah like, board slides. Tricks. Yeah, board slides and blunts are the same exact way. For a long time, like I was like, oh, I can do like front blunts because I'm moving forward. But yeah. I'm, and that's why I looked at it, I was like, oh, this is a back blunt because I'm backside at the rail and popping over. Yeah, it's whichever and way you're off. facing like the if, object, see, right? Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah that's, it's that's mad confusing. Man. Yeah, and I was that like, doesn't add up whatsoever. Yeah, I felt like an idiot for the longest time. Still should. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like, that's that's good trick. That's good trick. Cool, like, well, trick. Good trick. Cool trick. Cool trick. Yeah. Cool trick. Can you imagine cool like, trick. with Hayden's reality, like the Tony Hawk game? It's like cool trick into cool trick into bad trick into cool <laughs> trick into awesome trick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ten times multiplayer. Yeah. It's like yeah. my only nice three combo. tricks counted. Board did spin flip trick. Awesome. <laughs> I don't think we should say it's like flip. <laughs> it's just, just trick. No, just no, no, trick. just rotate. Yeah, rotate. But then on rotate an axis. X axis. Yeah, like what? X axis. 
Y X Y. How would that work? Either we get extremely mathematical or we're getting extremely dumb. Those are two options. So we're going to start being like X axis 90 degrees or we're going to like flip right, flip left. Flip right. Yeah, no, not heel, not kick. No, no, flip no more. No. It's too complicated. What is heel flip? I know left flip. Oh, but see, the flip left, flip right is going to get confusing for Switch. <laughs> yeah, true, but what, uh, yeah, and also, like, what if you're goofy versus regular? Like, if I do a yeah, left flip. You know what? Skinning goofy is illegal. All right, yeah. <laughs> see you guys. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, my left flip would be your right flip, so that, that could be another reason. Well, here's another thing I wanted to talk about. What do you think is cooler, reverted 180s or, like, crisp landed 180s? Where you know we, what I'm talking mm, about? Yes. It's you see, I feel subjective when it's going down. If you're doing a revert, like, back 180 down, like, a stair set, that's pretty fun. Him. That seems like it'd be very hard. That, yeah, that's, yeah. That's, that's, yeah. A, that's a hard one. So I if feel you're like doing it, you got the balls to let it hang. It depends on the spot and on the skater doing them. Because I, I do know some people where their 180s will literally be like at the peak of their pop late, mm. like midair, and they'll do it. And then I know I know people that will purposely like just do a like half assed ollie, land on that front uh, truck, and then just like swivel it around. And it's like. I guess it would look cool at a spot, but if I'm seeing it on flat, it's like, why Why don't you just try harder? Yeah. Like, it, it doesn't look that good if it's yeah. on flat. Yeah. Yeah, I but like I feel like on a five stair, yeah, it'd be pretty sick to see someone land on their front truck and then, you know, swivel. So but, um, for me, like on flat, be, I, I definitely like, I'm a late spinner on my yeah, back when it is. Like I time, land yeah. and like, you can hear like me just squealing. So like, yeah. like I can do them full rotated and I feel like my full rotation ones aren't really that like great looking. So I always just go with like the little reverb where it's like, it's like I'm almost there, like I'm landing like that, and it's like land, and then just keep going. Yeah. But I feel like if you're like rolling up to something, like say you're skating street and you're rolling up to hit a ledge, like switch, and you just do like a back 180, I feel like you need to rotate all the way. And it's yeah. gonna look weird if you just power yeah. slid it, like yeah. the rest. Plus yeah. definitely with like impact, you know, you'd have to get into the scrape territory. Yeah. Like Baker makers. Baker makers. Yeah. That should be thrown into illegal tricks, Baker makers. Uh, Scrapes, yeah. touching with your hands, like. I don't know, I've claimed many a Baker maker. I think it counts if you like, aren't supporting yourself with the hand. Like if you touch the ground, like you, you land oh, something massive, yeah, and you but, just like hit the ground, but I see you, what you're like, saying. Like you in Baker videos, up. they will literally like catch themselves on their hands and just like start sliding out, and then that would be the clip. Like they'll just do a power slide with their hands out after landing something. See, they'll I just throw it in there. I think full it, fledged part. I think it counts on like how big of the things they're doing. Like oh, if yeah. you're doing like a yeah. backside flip and like a 15 stair, and then like when you catch it, like you revert and then like you like kind of like slide yeah, yeah. Also I'll take like that transition one, yeah. too. I mean, if you're going yeah. to yeah. transition, you're like squatting it out, you know, just- Definitely. I mean, I, I feel like it's a make. Yeah. yeah. But when you get into the territory where it's not just like a little push and then you keep rolling, but you just like hold that spot, I feel like that's the cutoff. That's yeah, there, there's, there's, there's a gray area. Yeah, and that's like, definitely. That's a lot of what we're talking about. Tricks, illegal, what's good, what's bad. Yeah. It's a gray area. Like there's always gonna be like a it's subjective matter of opinion. Yeah. See like I like double flips. I think double flips look pretty cool. And there is but just like you said, it has to be one where like it looks super intentional and like you didn't just like the board happened to land face up and you happened to land on it. But right. like I, I I like a double flip. I knew a guy in middle school and that's like all he did. Just double kick, double heel. And See, that was like his there used to be a dude that would come to Wells, and he actually had like double flips on lock over boards. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But he couldn't do a regular kickflip. Yeah. It was weird. That's that's. Insane. I think I think it's more of like with that, it's like a power control. Yeah. Like you just don't have the the control of your foot to be able to just do a regular kickflip. Yeah. No, this guy would do like double kickflip over the parking stops, and then he could do triple kickflip on flat. Oof. Which what? I think I th I think that just is like triple. That goes yeah, past. Yeah. Triple well. is sort of. It's a little too you're, you're wild. Pushing it. Especially on flat. I feel like if, like, what is triple flips on flat? Like, bounce off the ground? Or would Definitely. it be fully? Yeah, because there's but no way that you're do doing it. a full triple flip. Like He would do it stationary. Ads. Like, he wasn't even rolling. And he would just what? blast it and just land it. And he could probably land it, like, probably 40 to 50% of the time. But he could also hit, like, the eight stair outside of the school. So, that dude was fucking nuts. Uh, but, anyways. Moving on. Uh, oh, did we die? No? 
We're still no. good. This is this thing has all the, had like a second wind or something. Second yes. wind. Yes. Yeah, we're still we're still live. As you can tell, Landable's podcast has gone through a little bit of improvement. We now have quality headsets. Uh, very high end sh- around here. You like might this. remember these from middle school. Yeah, or yeah, yeah. the hearing test. Yeah, ring yeah. a bell. <laughs> if you uh, oh, had the, a bell. If you got oh, on like an American man. Airlines flight and uh, asked for a set of headphones, that's what that's what I remember. These things are dog. Sh- but hey. We're uh, we're on a very small budget here. This is a one person show. Yeah, I can really I only I'm... half tell if I'm hearing myself in my headphones or just speaking. All uh, right. I think uh, I think our Popeyes today cost them more than these headphones. <laughs> I know. They did. No joke. We got yeah Popeyes for uh, for four cost considerably more than the setup we're running right now, headphones wise. Obviously, the recorder costs a little bit more. Okay. Well, anyways, to round it off, I have some tricks here that I wrote down. I know some of you guys will definitely know these, but if you can name all of these exactly, you become MVP and you get a high five. <clears throat> I was gonna do some sort of giveaway, but yeah, nothing around here for free to give away. So here we go. What is a Rick flip? Is that just a backside flip? Incorrect. I've definitely heard Rick flip. Of Rick flip. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, it's the Rick Howard flip, but I can't remember what the f- exactly. You guys give up? No. Wait, 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 wait. Is it? I know it's a it's a kick flip, right? It's a kick flip, but it's in a certain position. Yeah, I knew it was heel flip. It's heel. I knew it was heel flip. Oh, I don't know what the hell. I want to say is it heel flip? I want to say it's heel like flip. a pressure flip because a pressure flip's like no. Nah, I don't think it's that crazy. What is it? It's a fakey big heel. Ah, fakey big. Welcome back to Landed Bolts Podcast. Uh, recorder died, which is a mainstay here because we are remote and this thing only runs on two double A's. So we got us a while. four Phantom Power mics going off this bad boy and uh, we managed to make it almost 40 minutes. So we're going to go back. Um, we were talking about Rick Flips and no one... I'd like to take a guess. I yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, yeah, the Rick Flip, the uh, fakey big spin heel flip. So uh, no, no one got that one. All right, we're moving right down the line. Alpha flip. Front foot impossible, 180. Front side. Now I will say, what you described is this, but the internet listed it as something different. An alpha flip? An yes. alpha flip. Alpha that, flip. Oh, that's not what you said. Is an alpha flip like a... Uh, What'd you say it was? A front foot impossible leap 180. Flip? It kind of sounds like it could sound it, almost like this. It's like a rap big spin. So. More or less. This. No? Is it not really? The internet has listed it as hospital flip plus backside body burial. So. I think. So we have an well, expert. We have an expert well, here. But that, when I think of front foot <laughs> impossible, think? I'm thinking like front <laughs> three hospital. show. Yeah. Big spin hospital. Big spin hospital. See, yeah. See that? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. all of those things. The, really way, the way that yeah. I thought about it, though, is when I do front foot impossibles, they go yeah, when behind you, when you, me. Yeah, when you do yeah. your front foot impossibles. Like, yeah. I don't know how to do them backside. It's, what do you mean? All right. Uh, Roll the clip. Well, you know, Roll the clip. You, 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 know, you know what I call all these tricks so far besides the Rick flip? Illegal. Illegal. I wonder. Illegal. Yeah. Illegal. Don't pull that shit around me, bro. <laughs> all right. So we'll give, a, we'll give our co-host Matt credit for that one. Mm-hmm. That was very good. We that's, a, that's a high five right there. Very you nice. get a high five. Nicely done. Nicely done. Yeah. All right. I'm terrible at handshakes. Not enough Popeyes for you today. <laughs> Moving right on. We have the Merlin twist. Oh, oh, okay. No, this, this one's far. actually like, isn't it impossible? Yeah, this side? one, yeah. It it wraps in some way. I know that for a fact. Is it a front foot impossible backside? I think it's. It's so, something's wrapped. Right it's like somewhere. a big spin impossible, is it not? This one. So the exact definition, according to the internet. Remember, this is not me. Please, I see the comment section <laughs> lighten up right now. It is. So none of you guys have a full guess. No one. Talk about character. Maybe no. Definitely no one. Not. No guess. No. All right. The internet has listed this as a switch. Front foot impossible, front side 180. So literally what I lift as an alpha flip is switch. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Basically. Yep. That's all right. Ah, that's um, illegal. That's what that is. Illegal. I didn't even I didn't even know that it had to be switch. Wow, a lot of these 
I realized I have a lot of like hospital flip or impossible variations. That was a uh, not intentional bubble flip. Oh, I can't remember. Uh, bubble, bubble flip is when you fucking like you fucking like gorilla on the side of it. Oh, and, like, flip yep. it over. It's like <laughs> yeah. a, it's like a varial flip, but with no pop and no flick. You just like use your feet to cross it. This Wait, is, so <laughs> yeah. isn't that that's exactly what Jorge does? Yeah, right? yeah. No, pressure, yeah, Jorge does that all day. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that is. Uh, that's crazy. This is listing it as a pressure back foot hospital flip. Oh, well, but that's the yeah, internet. For that's you. it. Tack, yeah, tech right there. So, yeah, uh, so no, we're getting into the 1992 territory. Did anyone? Yeah. This is small wheels and curves as ledgers. <laughs> <laughs> All right, a. You guys should get this one. Ghetto bird. Yeah, okay, okay, does it have to be Nolly or are we just no, saying it no, car flip? No, Gettleburn is Nolly. Okay, just making sure that everyone's on the same boat as me, yeah. No, so, Nolly hard flip, laid back Kareem. 180. Huh? Everybody's on the same boat as Kareem Campbell. <laughs> now this? Well, no, because I've gotten in arguments where I tell people about Ghetto Birds and people are like, it doesn't have to be Nolly. When has he ever said it has to be Nolly? I swear Kareem, in an interview, has said it has to be Nolly. I always thought it was fakey because you. Cause oh yeah, no, the way that he does it, he makes it look like it's fake. Because he, like, he rolls like, up Nolly, but like you know, he's coming down. A little yeah, bit. the internet. It's pretty it's neat how he does it. Yeah, well, the internet's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> when Straight is up, it, hey, the internet is wrong. Get on this. Our ghetto birds fakey. It's only? Nolly. We got our expert down here. Like this, okay, it's like that Steve Cab with Cabs thing, where it's like I, you'd have to ask him because everybody does ghetto birds on flat there. Yeah. Yeah. Like the original. Yeah. On a bank yeah. too. So does it have to be on a bank? Right. Oh, that's, that's a good. Another... That's a good thing bringing up cab too, because everybody yeah, says sure. front cab, but like cab was like, well, the cab was backside. Yeah, I true. swear. I in an interview, he said that it's backside, and then someone else tried bringing up to me that cab has said that it goes both ways in an interview, and I was like, pull it up. Ooh, I've never shit. once yeah, heard you Steve like, say that. No. This like, guy, it's bro. definitely just backside. Show this me dude. that receipt. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this guy gets beefy over some fucking trick names. Yeah, no, I uh, I always considered it to be backside. Yeah. And I have people say like, oh, I'm gonna do a front cab. And I'm like, well, what is that? Front, fakey yeah, front, yeah, 180, fakey front. All right, all right, yeah. We got our expert in here, Dylan. I've never seen Steve Cab do a frontside cab on Vert, especially. But no. Right. <laughs> no, he has. I, I second that. I think he has the authority. To Oh, Ooh. Ooh. yo! So Steve we need we need somebody confirmed. to go do that right now, and then go name that. Phoning in, yeah. Steve Cavalier. Yeah, 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 Steve Cab has no authority over Cavalier. Dude, he's coming in with his rainbow half cab. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> his camo pants. <laughs> Dude, he dresses like a middle schooler. Oh no! <laughs> Sorry, Steve. Uh, Dude, we're slandering a lot of pros. Please this don't this watch. Episode. You know exactly what I'm talking about, too. This, Why is he dressed like that? This episode <laughs> got some got some of that spice in it. Dude, we're not getting a van sponsor. We're not getting a Popeye sponsor. Popeye's Supreme's still on the table now. <laughs> I don't think Supreme. Ah, uh, the board's also oh, we can't even well. see it, but whatever. Yeah. Anyway, the skate gods are not on our side for this episode. Yeah, yeah no, on our we, side for five uh, I forgot my liquid death mountain water and my clean energy drink. Ah, dang. <laughs> That sucks. All right, moving right on. Thank God Very I have so this pastel cartel Escobar. Nightmare flip. <laughs> Nightmare, oh, Nightmare flip. Uh, uh, let me say, dope. I know this you one. You guys know this one, yeah. Yeah, it's a varial flip, but it flips twice. So it's a double, double flip. The internet says varial double flip, like so what you said yeah. was totally Varial double wrong. flip, yeah. I've done one by accident. You said flip. You said flips twice, and it also says illegal. double flip. Big, big illegal. So. It's uh, man. It's yeah. Wow. This is what I'm saying. We gotta Half say credit. x-axis. You know. Yeah. X-axis 360. But here's the deal, though. It, it flips kind of on the z, the z axis. The z. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I don't think you can really claim that it's on. Anyways, daydream flip. Uh, isn't it just double varial heel? Boom. It's the exact opposite. Look yeah. at mm. that. Boom. Also, Disgusting. according to the internet, some people claim it has to be nollie. Hmm. To make I, it the I've never full heard that, opposite but... of a nightmare. Film. Well, it's, wow, it's a good so... thing that, you know. It's a good thing that the internet is f***ing. The internet is always yeah. wrong. Yeah, because yeah. Nolly, because Nolly Varial Heel was also illegal. Illegal as f***. All right. Nolly Varial Heel, yeah. that yeah. does illegal. not sound like it would look good at all. All right, I got one more here. Dragon Flip. Ooh, what's that one? Uh, Dragon Flip's a double front forward flip, right? Yeah. Double Dolphin. Double and dolphin. do we want to go into how a dolphin flip is just a vertical barrel flip? No, I think that I think right there was good enough. I don't, want, I, don't, I, don't, I don't really want to talk about dolphin flips more than just saying the name. Yeah. <laughs> now, do you like dolphin flip or forward flip more? Dolphin. 
sounds cool. Yeah, dolphin sounds yeah. better. Yeah. Four yeah. flips also. Like, uh, like, like the name of it or like? Yeah, just the name, just the pure yeah. name. I'm gonna say four flip. I'm gonna say dolphin flip. I feel corny as hell. Yeah. And when I, kinda, I say four flip, I feel equally as corny, but I feel a little bit better about myself. I more like, modest. I like four flip. More modest. Yeah. More modest. It's yeah. like it's like it's like the adult version. I'm of gonna it. start shorthanding front side flips to front flips. Front flips. Yeah. <laughs> I think a front flip is the same with trick. back flips. It's like yo, he's in a front uh, flip. I think you're thinking of a gainer. A gainer. Yeah, a gainer. Yeah. A I'm gainer. gonna do a gainer on my board, boys. Yeah. Right. Get a little off top. Gainer. Anyways, that's a um, trick I would shoot for. So, yeah, I would say we did uh, fairly well. I would say Matt knew the most. I think Matt was uh, very in tune on that Matt one. That's why I said we need to bring him on. He is the trick connoisseur. Yeah. Yeah. Have, me and you have argued over tricks for a while now. Shout out to uh, Rad Rat Skateboards. Oh, I get all of my info Rad from Rat. him. For yeah, sure. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yo, Rad every Rat. Day, every new episode. Yo, hold on a second. Watch Rad it. Rat, what happened to you on fucking Nine Club? Fuck Nine Club. Chris Roberts. <laughs> oh no. We're Kelly getting, Hart, you were, were kind of cool, but what you said was me. Hey, let's dial it back here. Uh, Chris Halsam, you're, you're cool. Yeah, like Chris Halsam, nice. Uh, and yeah, that's all I got to say about yeah, that. Yeah, Landed Bull's way better than Nine Club. Let's be real here. Honestly, yeah. Production yeah. value, I mean, Ordering just a everything. cease and desist on Nine Club for stealing our idea <laughs> yeah. about what, five, six years earlier than us? Yeah, I don't see Nine Club filming at the, at the local. Yeah. Yeah. Where yeah. where does Nine Club film their stuff? Dude, in some Chris secret bunker. <laughs> yeah, some secret bunker. <laughs> this basement. The secret Nine Club this garage bunker, yeah. underneath Venice Park. Well, you guys notice how I'm okay. Wait, no, this is a yeah. Uh, anyways, off off yeah. so that was just a little a uh, little bit about tricks. Um, anything else you guys want to put a little stinger on the end there? Something something spicy. Any last minute thoughts? One more illegal slander. What are we? What are our thoughts on burials in general? Mm. Nah, like flips? mad legal. Flips yeah, mad illegal. Nah, no, no, mad legal. Mad legal. Are we and talking doing, like burial flips or like the hand heel, like? Oh, well, yeah. Nah, yeah, like street street burials. Yeah, no, yeah. definitely legal. I like seeing burial flips getting a comeback. I, nah, they, yeah. There was a lot of hate for years, but I feel like they're yeah. they're I, being cool. See, definitely, yeah. the hate has fluctuated. Like I that. feel like the hate came from people like were like, oh, it's too. It's not cool enough because it's not going yeah. all the way. I had also heard it takes reportedly. More, it takes more control to do a very For sure. I had yep. heard um, back yep. in the early days when magazine ads were still like, you know, just taking photos of tricks, barrel flips, you couldn't really like yeah, you couldn't tell. tell. You couldn't tell what was happening. You just had a name call it and people would have to take your word for it because it's, it's weird to get a good but angle of a barrel flip and note it. So. That's true. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Every trick in the yeah. Unless it's, like it's a whole sequence, yeah, you yeah. don't know what's going on. Maybe it's just that a was really something long someone made up it. just to just to piss her hey, let, me, uh, let me let me chime in with one more. Ollie South. Oh. Um, if you're doing ollie souths, you just need to work on your ollies. <laughs> you just need to pull the board up more. You just need to bring your foot hey, up. Yeah, I know more. someone who has the cleanest ollie south out here. No handed Benihana. No hand Benihana. Real trick. Nah, Benihana. okay, hold on a second. Real if you're doing no, no handed Benihana, I want to see the fing tail like, slap. Oh, yeah, no, I'd have to bone it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That is the way that trick. I'm going to call it that, and even then, I'm not going to respect you for doing wow. that. Yo, uh, Benihana <laughs> should not be illegal. IMO. Let's be real. Yeah, yeah. I also, love Benihana. okay, I think about Benihana's. Is that the like? That's actually like not what the trick is called. Yeah, Benihana is trademarked as fing, right? No, it's like, that's the, it's a different trick entirely than what we think it's is It's not a tail grab sound? Oh no, it's, yeah, you're, it's, it's, no wait. Benihana, no, it's, Benihana's are actually, I gotta, I gotta go my Dylan, off, are off yeah, Dylan, 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 Dylan's better than me at this. Man. No, okay, so, okay, so Benihana's are actually supposed to be with the back foot. The, the dude who I actually wait, came what? up with doing, back, like, Benihana's was talking about it. He was like. You take your front foot off? Yeah, you take your front foot <laughs> off, and you grab it so with like the nose, a, and then you bring it back. But we always talk about Benihana's So like a judo being, kick nose? Grab. Yeah, exactly. I've never even, I don't even think that I've seen that type of grab. I heard right? they were first done fakie on a ramp. Like, so it's just, you're oh, wait, really? Oh, so then maybe yeah. that's where the confusion comes from because it's still back foot, right? Well, but, I, was, I just saw a thing, and I'm, if I'm recalling it correctly, if I'm wrong, you know, talk to me in the comments. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Hit that comment button. Hit that comment button. Tell Type me Type out wrong. that comment that, you know, we should, you know, hang it up. Hit sin, bro. That's that's all you gotta do. Yeah, we got our we got our fingers in the pulse of skateboarding right now. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I, I I'm I'm pretty sure I saw a video or an article or something where they were talking to the dude who like actually did like Benny Hanna, like the guy who came up with Benny Hanna, Mr. Benny Hanna himself. Yeah. And um, it wasn't like a yeah, and Japanese he, thing. Yeah, yes. and he was talking about 
it's like it's when you're coming up and you're going regular, your front foot comes off. So the board is like inside your thigh on your back leg and then you grab the nose and bring it in. I don't even want to- But we think of Binihana as, you know, front foot and you grab tail. I don't even want to think about that going wrong. Yeah. But yeah, yeah that's all I got to say about Benihana. Hmm. Also illegal trick. That's I think a, it looks that's cool. A little, I think it should be legal. That's a, that's a little Benihana's kid trick. Yeah, people say the Benihanas are one of the easier grabs. You can, you can get that in about a day. In about a day. Yeah. About one run. I've done a few. Yeah, I think they don't feel yeah. good. This no. is they a don't Matt feel challenge. good either. No, I did. I, I spent like a Matt night. Matt challenge to get Benihana in a day. I spent like. <laughs> Not for me though, for everyone else listening. I'm... Matt's got. We are back for the third time here at Land Bolts Podcast. Absolutely stomping the environment uh, with two sets of batteries today. Anyways, this has been episode four. Let us know what you think in the comments. Um, make sure to hit that like button. We are always improving, as you can see, with our high-tech equipment. But, uh, yeah, this has been Landed Bolts Podcast. Make sure to like, make sure to follow, make sure to subscribe. Hit us up on Instagram at Landed underscore Bolts underscore podcast. And uh, yeah, you could be one of our very tight-knit community members. Currently sitting at about 15 subs. But anyways, uh, yeah, we will see you next time. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll see you there. Episode five coming soon. We out. <laughs>